Welcome to the recorded class using eClaims for PracticeWork software. By the end of this class, you should be able to submit claims electronically, transmit claims, and print reports. The eClaims service enables you to electronically send claims to payers. If you are not currently an eClaims subscriber, contact your CareStream representative for more information at 800-262-8593. Submitting Claims Electronically When you check a patient out, the Submit Electronically option is selected automatically for any claims that can be sent electronically. Leave this option selected and click OK. The claim is placed in the Submission Claims list, the batch that will be transmitted to the eClaims service. Continue adding claims to the batch throughout the day. Transmitting Claims you must validate and transmit the claims to complete the process. From the main menu, select Activities, eClaims Service. The Submission Claims List window is displayed. Use this window to manage claims. Select Send All to select all claims in the list. The Status in the Send column displays Yes for all claims. Highlight a claim and click Don't Send to hold the claim during this transmission. Highlight the claim again and click Send to remove the hold. Information related to the claim is displayed in the lower portion of the window. You can view information about the insurance company, patient, and insured party. Select a claim and click View Transactions to see the procedure codes, charges, and ledger balance. Select a claim and click Submission Details to see the claim details and to add any remarks before the claim is sent. Click OK to begin the claim validation process. The software checks each claim for possible errors and displays a prompt with the number of claims that passed validation. If errors are encountered, you will have the option to correct them before transmitting. Click Yes when prompted to transmit. After the claims have been sent, a window prompts you to view any reports that were generated during the validation process. Click Yes. Printing Reports The PracticeWorks eServices Reports window is displayed. Select from the list of existing reports or click Retrieve Reports to connect and receive any pending reports. Under View File Types, select the type of reports you want to view. Options include Transmission Reports, Validation Errors, User Information, or Statement Reports. New reports are indicated by New in the Status column. Click Print All to send all reports to the printer or highlight new reports one at a time and click Print. The Transmission Summary Report provides a list of claims sent in the most recent transmission. The Transmission Log is a confirmation from the eClaims Clearinghouse that the previous day's claims were received and processed. This report serves as a receipt for the transmitted batch. The Claim Status Report indicates the current status of recently submitted claims. ACC stands for Accepted and means that the claim was accepted by the clearinghouse or insurance company. REJ stands for Rejected and includes a reason. Rejected claims must be fixed and resubmitted. If the rejection is due to lack of coverage, the balance should be billed to the patient. REQ means the insurance company requires additional information, such as images or charts. Provide the information by mail or phone. When mailing the additional documentation, include the DCN number from this report. The Account Balance Summary Report provides the billing status of your practice, the number of claims sent daily, and the current account balance. If you pay by automatic credit card draft, this report lists the date and amount charged and serves as your receipt for accounting purposes. For prepaid accounts, remit payment when your account falls below $25. The Validation Errors Report provides a list of claims that are missing information or have invalid data preventing them from being sent. These errors must be fixed before claims can be sent to the insurance company. This concludes the class using eClaims for PracticeWork software. Now you should be able to submit claims electronically, transmit claims, and print reports.
If you have any comments or questions about this content, please contact us and reference the content code located in the lower right corner of this slide.